The school year is starting for some Indiana students and police have a message for anyone driving near a school zone. Fox 59's Claire Curry shows us what they want you to keep in mind. Beach Grove students are back in class as of Wednesday and their school buses are back on the road. While kids are waiting at the bus stop, cars passing by should be aware of what's going on around them. Lieutenant Nathan Rinks adds kids need to follow the rules of the road as well. Reach out to that school district and let them know because we'll talk to those kids and say, hey, you know, we got reports or we, we saw a video of you running out in front of a car or throwing rocks or whatever it is that, that's creating an unsafe situation. Crossing guards are also at many busy intersections to help students walking or biking to school. Overall, he just encourages drivers to slow down and pay attention, including young student drivers. There's people who are just driving too fast and are looking at their phone, they're distracted, and before they realize the bus has stopped, they're going around them and blowing past the stop arm. He says that impatient drivers flying by the bus stop arm is a problem everywhere, and central Indiana is no exception. In 2023, bus drivers here recorded more than 2,000 cars ignoring the flashing red lights in a single day. But officers try to be vigilant to get students to school safely. And they try to put officers strategically throughout the city where the buses are going to be to watch for those stop arms. And I believe they already uh, wrote tickets to two people yesterday. Rinks add stop arm violations are one of the worst non-alcohol related driving charges to receive. You do not want to get a stop arm violation. It, it will really affect your insurance. It's going to give you lots of points. It's going to cost a lot of money. And that's just if you go through it without hurting somebody. Drivers that violate the stop arm law can be fined upwards of $10,000 and can have their license suspended for upwards of 90 days. Reporting in Beach Grove, Claire Curry, Fox 59 News. Indeed.